Why do we live in a society full of labels? I think in reality, we as humans love labels. We love to be defined by something and labels do that for us. But when we define ourselves with labels, we also confine ourselves with labels. When I was little, I was convinced that I was a superhero. I thought I had these superpowers and they just hadn't surfaced yet. Um, but when I got these superpowers, I wanted to be the best superhero that people knew of. And I'd be branding the superhero. I, Unlike the rest of the superheroes, I wanted to be known as a superhero. And as vain as that sounds, I think what was going on was because I was just this nerdy kid um, that wanted to be something more, to be someone more. Yeah, when I got to high school, this materialized even more. I wanted to be defined as the athlete or the musician. When I didn't live up to these labels or these achievements, I felt like I was nothing. And in a society full of labels, not having a label is in itself a label. Now, obviously, it's not bad to want to succeed at something. It's not bad to want to succeed at sports or at music. But when we start defining ourselves by the things that we do, our mistakes catch up. What I mean is this. The other day, I was with a friend and I was telling them that um, that Heath Ledger was the, the only actor to win an Oscar for a superhero role. And they asked me, who's Heath Ledger? And my immediate response was he was the actor that overdosed. And that's what I mean. No matter how much we succeed in life, our mistakes will always be there because we're human. We make mistakes. That's what we do. But here's the thing, is that you are so much more than the things that you do. You're so much more than your achievements. You're so much more than your mistakes. Because no matter how much you don't believe it, you are loved and you have the capability to love and that in itself is something that you can't put a label on. You can't contain that. That's the beauty of you. I think um, recently there's just been this trend of our generation, we're really attracted to like these personality tests like Myers-Briggs or the Enneagram. Uh, if you guys don't know what that is, it's basically these tests that like you take them and it kind of um, categorizes you based on your personality and I think why we're so attracted to this is because we want to be defined and our generation especially we don't know who we are as individuals so we look to tests to tell us I think as a generation we need to start to break out of these labels but I think it looks different for every single one of us on a day-to-day -day basis but Maybe for you, it means recognizing your successes and breaking out of that and letting go of that. Or maybe recognizing your failures and letting go of that. Or maybe um, if you don't know who you are as an individual, maybe you should avoid those personality tests. Maybe it means just trying new things. I don't know, I'm not sure. But I do know that you are so much more than the things that you do. You are loved.